Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'm going to walk you through my leg workout for the day. This is a great workout to do that can really help you build muscle and build strength as well. Let's go ahead and dive in. I walk you through today's workout a couple things I want to say what I recommend doing if you do want to add this workout to your routine is stick to this routine for at least four weeks in a row in your split okay a good workout split would be the classic push pull and legs and if you notice the videos that I posted and I'll also link them at the end of this video I'm posting my current splits and workouts that you can literally take these videos to the gym with you and go through push pull legs three different workouts for about six to eight weeks you will see massive results if you're challenging yourself and focusing on increasing the weight in this routine over the course of six to eight weeks in the video you're gonna notice when I put the captions on there's warm-up sets and there's working sets warm-up sets are just that they're performed at a light weight what this does is help prime your central nervous system to lift a heavier weight and also reinforces good technique to make sure the lift is going to be at maximum efficiency when I say a working set this is going to be the weight that you're going to challenge yourself at take this into account as we walk through the workout if you end up using this leg workout as part of your split and you're able to complete all repetitions and all sets this simply means that the weights you were using were not heavy enough and not enough to challenge you in order for your body to change and grow. The other thing that you'll see is RPE. What this stands for is rate of perceived exertion. This is a scale of intensity and challenge on a scale of one to 10, 10 being the most intense and most challenging. For your warm up sets, you want to start with three out of 10, five out of 10, and just challenge yourself a little bit to get ready for those working sets. For the working sets, they're going to be eight out of 10, and by the time you reach the fourth or fifth or maybe sixth set on a particular exercise, you're definitely gonna be at a 10 out of 10 RPE, or at least you should be, and this is what's gonna make your muscles change and grow. Make sure you stay until the end of the video because two other things that we need to talk about to make sure that you're seeing progress in your body transformation is your calorie intake and your protein intake. Let's go ahead and jump into today's workout. All right, all right, all right. Let's jump into the workout. First lift that we have is we are on the leg press. So this is an angled leg press. One thing you wanna do is you wanna have your feet more narrow on this one as it is a more quad dominant machine and exercise really focus on letting the weight come all the way down so you're keeping tension on those quads and your legs and then squeezing contracting all the way at the top second lift we're moving on to a romanian deadlift also known as a straight leg deadlift so if you notice we went from quads and now we're moving into hamstrings or working the posterior chain if you want to get fancy and use that name one uh Fun fact about Romanian deadlifts, you may not know, it's actually called a Romanian deadlift because this is the technique that Roman soldiers used to use in order to pick the dead bodies up off the battlefield. So bet you didn't know that or you might have, I don't know. Anyways, what you want to make sure you're doing when you're doing Romanian deadlifts, super important, you're going to have what I call soft knees, just barely bent, not locked out. And then you'll see from the side view here, the most important thing is that you hinge your hips backwards and keep that straight spine. So if you watch me right here, my spine is entirely straight. We're gonna work the hammies, we're gonna work the glutes on this one. And once you get to the higher weights, you'll definitely be hitting a little bit heavier weight. So leg extension here is the next exercise. Quad focus exercises, what we're gonna be doing here. You really wanna focus on contracting and squeezing all, that guy's trying to take my phone, man. Shoot, now he's returning it. Nah, he's, he was cool about it. He thought uh, my phone was his. We had the same case. And I caught him on camera. But anyways, so yeah, man, uh, we're going to get back to the leg extensions. And again, we want to fully contract and squeeze at the top. And I noticed one thing you want to do is watch yourself on video because I noticed that I'm really not contracting all the way at the top, which means I need to lower the weight. Last exercise, again, is calf raises standing. 
and this is gonna be it man this is just gonna be a nice little leg workout these are super intense if you're doing all the sets at a working weight it is really challenging the next two videos that you want to watch are the video on how many calories you should eat to lose weight or build muscle and how much protein you should eat in order to lose weight and build muscle. I also have a list of the other two workouts that I mentioned in push, pull, and legs. So there are four videos that you wanna follow after this one that'll really set the entire foundation for you to have a successful body transformation. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Feel free to leave any comments. Go lift hard and I'll see you next time. Peace.